present among us. Listen to the Spirit say, I am here with you. Face to face or far away, God is present among us. Listen to your family say, It's day four of our compassion camp and our theme today is traveling. Sometimes we travel to be with people, friends and family. Sometimes we travel long distances to be with people that we've gotten to know over the years. I've got on my traveling vest from Namibia where I've traveled five times to visit friends and people I've gotten to know there who are other Lutherans just like we are. I've even brought together my favorite giraffe, and some pictures or postcards. Sometimes we collect those to remember places where we've been and people we knew. These were people that I've met in Namibia and traveled with. And these are some new friends that I made when I was there. And these were new friends that I would have liked to bring home, my giraffe and my elephants, but they wouldn't fit in my suitcase. When we get together tonight, bring something that you remember, use to remember a place you've traveled to, to be with others. Maybe a picture or a postcard or a favorite t-shirt or a seashell, something that you may have gathered together with your family. We'll see you then, bye. Hi friends, it's so good to be with you here today to get ready for our session four of Compassion Camp. I've been working on my mural, I hope you have too. It's got lots of interesting things going on in it, all kinds of people and places and things to get together to show compassion to each other. I have some questions for you this morning, and I'd like you to answer with the first thing that comes to your mind. Who's always there for Minnie Mouse? Who's always there for Iron Man? Who's always there for people in danger? Who's always there for people who are sick? Who's always there for children? And who is always there for you? Now that seemed pretty easy, but I'm wondering, what does always there really mean? Does it mean to be there for someone? Does it mean that you're actually by their side, holding their hand or giving them a hug? What does it mean to be there for people who are sick or for the poor or for the hungry or for your family or even for yourself? Another way of saying this is being present with someone. If I want to be present with a friend, I wait, I listen to what they have to say, and I ask how I can support them best. It means thinking of them before thinking of yourself. Today we're present with each other and let's take a few seconds of silence to just be with one another. Being present, remember, means listening, waiting, and asking how you can support one another. When we are together or apart, God is always with us. God is always present, no matter where we go, how we feel, or what we need. And we can be present for each other in many ways, too. In the story today, we will meet three women, Naomi, Ruth, and Orpa, who figured out how to be present with each other when they were hurting and needed to travel to a new place to live. The memory verse for our day is from that story, from the book of Ruth, chapter 1, verse 16. Where you go, I go, and where you live, I'll live. Your people are my people, and your God is my God. Let's end our time together this morning with our compassion prayer for today. Remember, we're going to place one hand on our head and one hand on our heart. And we're doing this because compassion happens in our brains, but we feel it in our hearts. 
Let us pray. Loving Spirit, you are active and alive, always moving and always stirring within and around us. Please be an encouraging wind at our backs, giving us open minds and soft hearts to follow where you lead. Make us present in each moment that we might embrace compassion by letting go of what we expected. Amen. I made another drawing, it's a rainbow, because a rainbow is a symbol of hope and promise that we believe in, that God made to all of us. But the words in it say, do small things with great love. Mother Teresa said that, and she had a lot of love even when she didn't have a lot of things. But we can all do small things. Make a picture, take a picture of it, so you can share it with us when we gather together tonight. See you then. among us listen to the spirit say i am here with you face to face or far away god is present among us listen to your family say i am here with you as close as your breath, your beating heart, I am here with you. As far as you go, no matter the time, I am here with you. Face to face or far away, God is present among us. Listen to your community say, As you go, no matter the time